52 seconds for northern back 40 for kramnik goes queen c2 knight f e5 would be a nice move will kramnik find that or he plays queen e3 also good one also good one he needs to keep his time about 10 to 15 seconds he shouldn't come really down otherwise he will blunder it g5 is attacked now has to be careful if g4 there is knight h4 guys bishop h4 uh what did he do? He goes knight c3, but now knight takes g5 is hanging. Can Kramnik beat Nodirbek? That would be a major upset. And Kramnik there knows that he's got his opponent by the scruff of his neck. This is his chance to pounce. He must take on g5. He takes it. Takes the pawn on g5. And now, what's next? Actually, knight b1 might be his idea. No, he goes knight e2, but there's no threat as such. Kramnik can go knight e5. He can bring back his knight. He can also go knight h3. And then maybe put his knight on f4. That could be an idea. With 18 seconds. No, there is knight e2. Oh, no, they're back down to 10 seconds. He goes knight e2. Now he plays knight e2. Now knight h3. Let's go. Kramnik plays knight 2 h3. Finds another brilliant move. Queen d1. So the knight shouldn't move because there is a check coming here. So the knight can remain there. The pawn can start pushing. He fights. What play by the legend. Kramnik playing ultra brilliant chess. Takes on d4. Take the knight. Take the knight. Doesn't matter. Takes it. Bishop takes. Queen g5 check. King f8. Pushes the pawn. The king is safe. The pawns are running down. Check here. Gain some time. Gain a pawn. Bishop goes back. Dodirbek is lost. Kramnik just has to keep his cool now. Can he maintain his cool? That is the question. Eight seconds. I think he's under pressure for sure. He's, but I think he'll manage. He'll manage. Check King H2. And now six seconds. Dodirbek needs to make a move. Oh, he's going to lose a tight bishop D4. C7 coming in. No, no, no. C7. You will lose the queen. Queen C7. Yeah, bishop E5. And queen d8 played. Nodirbek's resistance is brilliant. As Gukesh mentioned in his interview. Nodirbek is known for his defensive skills here. And uh, Kramnik unable. Oh, 4 seconds, 3. Come on, Kramnik. Don't lose your time. This is very important. Kramnik must fight here. Queen e5. King h7. This is real street fight, guys. Now king g8. And... 4 seconds, 3, Queen e5 is unable to win this. 3-fold repetition. 3-fold repetition, arbiter called. Kramnik is like, how can you pause the clock? Nodirbek says, I have repeated this 3 times. But, I think there is no repetition. King is on g8. Or is it? Maybe if he goes to h7, there could be a repetition. Tanya Karelli, who is an arbiter, comes in and checks. Unbelievable. There, Kramnik gets up from the board. I think Nodirbek has made a very smart call here. Because, I don't know at what point, Queen e5, so you need to find this position. Has it been repeated three times at some point? Queen e5, King h7. This is, I think, the first time. Ah, man, I can't go through this. Let the arbiters decide if there was a repetition or not. But I think, yeah, this was the second time perhaps. And this is the third time with King H7 coming up. Maybe, maybe not so sure because the first time it was perhaps white's move. Now it's black's move. I'm not sure. Not sure. But I think it could be a draw. What do you think, guys? I think there was a threefold repetition. But... Uh, there you have there Kramnik checking there also with Nodirbek uh, and the Arbiter. This is not an easy job for the Arbiters by any means. They have to be, they have to be very, very, very uh, alert because the entire tournament's result depends on it. And Kramnik is like, where's the repetition? And Nodirbek is like, I'm going to play King at 7 now. So, oh my god. So it's three times. And Kramnik would be so livid with himself because and Nodirbek is enjoying himself. I think Nodirbek just knows that this is a draw, which means that he would be in great spirits for the Armageddon. But Kramnik played so well. It was just that he couldn't finish it. Couldn't finish the game. Is it a draw?
or they are back. Oh! Oh yes, it's a draw. It's a draw. Nadir Beck says, very sorry. But what presence of mind by the Uzbek youngster. I mean, guys, just think about it. He was down to five seconds. And you know, in this, I cannot even find a move what to play. And this guy actually remembers that it was a threefold repetition, claims a draw and gets it.